Minister of National Security Edmund Dillon is advising citizens that a funeral service for late President George Maxwell Richards is open to the public on a first-come, first-serve basis. A state funeral will take place on Wednesday, the 17th of January 2018 at the National Academy for the Performing Arts, Napa, Port of Spain, from 10 a.m. The public will be invited to the funeral of the former president by invitation only. A limited number of invitations will be distributed to the public on a first-come basis, first-come, first-serve basis, and will be available at Napa Box Office on Tuesday, the 16th of January, 2018. The time will be subsequently disclosed. The family has requested and has been granted that the viewing and the funeral will be open casket. I repeat, the viewing and the funeral will be open casket. Delon spoke at a media briefing on Sunday morning when he made the announcement. As for public viewing, he said there will be a public viewing on Monday and Tuesday. The body of the late former President Max Wichel would lay in state on Monday, the 15th of January, 2018, at the Parliament of Trinidad and Tobago with public viewing from 11 a.m. to 5.45 p.m. On Tuesday, the 16th of January, 2018, the body will be escorted through the St. Augustine campus of the University of the West Indies from 7.45 a.m. en route to Napa, Port of Spain, where it will lay in state from 10 a.m. to 5.45 p.m. The government of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago will open condolence books across Trinidad and Tobago for signing by members of the public. He said the condolence books would be also available for members of the public to sign. Thursday, the 18th of January, 2018, and Friday, the 19th of January, 2018, from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. The public is asked to note that the condolence book will not be available for signing on Wednesday, the 17th of January, 2018. The late president passed away on Monday, January 8th, after congestive heart failure. Sherilyn Lewis, CNews.